Welcome, I'm so glad you could be here. I'm the Emperor and this is Dungeons 4 and we are playing Mission 18, the Rune Sockets of Finitude Part 1, our hard difficulty. And again, we're going to try and see whether or not we can make maybe an achievement or two. So what do we need to do in this mission? Advance all faction research into level 10. Oh god. <laughs> right. Train 5 units to above level 10. Okay. And when one of your creatures dies permanently, you receive a random ghost hero on the same level. Oh, that's cool. Transform 15 heroes in the ice room. I like this mission already. It's gonna be a long one, for sure, but it has all the things that I like to do, and I like this. When one of your creatures dies permanently, you receive a random ghost hero of the same. That's pretty amazing. I want this skill. So let's go play it. And what shall we do? Talia's Might? Nah. I think... Uh, we're gonna go for Undead. So best we go for Undead Research as well. Well, not Undead Research, but boosting the Undead. So we're gonna kick out the Horde Research here. And we're gonna put in the Undead bonus thing. And I think that's pretty much it. Might kick this out for that. So Demon and Undead. For this mission. Hmm. What would you pick? I ask. Of course we're going for all of these. So reducing the research cost actually isn't a bad thing. I think we can do without this. So we'll reduce the research cost instead. And... Yeah, we'll leave it at this. We'll leave it at that. Let's see what the mission is about. How did I get here? What are we doing here? I thought we were just going to put the stones in the gauntlet. Talia and the stone snatching evil had all five stones of finitude together. For these to be mounted into the gauntlet of finitude, they would first have to be inserted into the ritual rune sockets of finitude. What? What's this bullshit? Tristan just inserted the damn things into the gauntlet? No, you just didn't see that sequence. It happened off screen. The hell he did! I watched him do it myself. Ah, oh, okay. I suppose there's no way I can get out of this. And did I hear you correctly earlier when you said part one? <laughs> Each of the stones had to be taken to its corresponding room socket. Talia and the not getting wound up about artificially prolonged game time evil set to work. Oh, well, I'm they sure must confuse you with the different evil then. <laughs> It almost looks like someone wanted to get a few more levels in, just because there were 20 missions in Dungeons 3. All right. And now, okay, just not yet. Someone is afraid of a few bad reviews. I have to put in an extra shift. Well, thanks a lot, you out there. But hey, what the hell? Let's get going. Show the gormless developers that we can jump through a few extra hoops on top of everything else. Onward, creatures! Find those rune sockets! Get the normal stones, the non-rune stones there, and let's finally put this freaky thing to bed! Alright, now, so I re received a few uh, very helpful tips and tricks in, in one of the comments on one of the previous videos, such as that you can order your horde underground to attack a specific target by right-clicking it, so we give it a little slap. I like that tip for sure. Uh, already seeing a different approach I want to take here. So, we're gonna dig in there. Gonna dig around here. I'm gonna dig through here. And then we open up from this side more or less like so because I want to make sure that they walk through lava as much as po oh actually if we want to make sure they walk through lava as much as possible we might as well let them come in through here Ah, well, well, we'll see. We'll figure it out. 
I don't have to optimize this path just now. We'll build it all out. A little bit. So another thing was about... Making sure we manage our, our snots a little bit better. That, that was some, um, let's say, valid criticism for sure. <laughs> so I shouldn't do all these build commands all the time. Because that obviously puts them away from mining gold. But here's gold in there, so... It all works out, I suppose. Let's build out a little bit. So we just need to place the stones. We gotta deal with all this here. Okay, I don't think on this end we can actually move them through this lava yet. But we for sure can force them through this lava. So we get them through here. And then we want them basically going straight. We'll pick up all that gold. I do hear some spiders, so maybe we can corral them through spider nests. We'll see. We'll, we'll build it all out. First, I want to make sure... Okay, maybe... Oh, God. So, we're supposed to train creatures, right? Let's upgrade our snots. Start start here. Upgrade that. Um, upgrade that. No, buy the training room. Uh, we'll, we want undead more than anything, I think. So... Okay. Oh, man. It's a difficult choice right now. Traps are important. This is important for undead to be sensible. Mm, uh. Okay, maybe we go with more horde creature to begin with. I mean, the research here is lower for us, so we can have a good army of the horde. We need to upgrade this. So other creatures can also train in here. So let's make it a variation and also get a door from what we have early on. Help our snots a little bit. And do we even have anything yet? We have nothing yet. So let's build a horde um, home base. Have dug up a spider. Let's build a training room right next to it. We'll build through here, and we'll see what what we might do there eventually. Uh, all right, spider. Let's get all these guys. Get all that gold so they don't do anything rash. It's payday. And okay, so the way I want to do this is we're gonna close this here and this here, and we wanna dig around there so they so we can close this up as well that's what i'm thinking there so let's get us some creatures in here just so we're not completely ill prepared And let's get a training room going. Okay, let's dig this out a little bit further. And then we can dig through here as well. All this way, honestly. Can I rotate this? I don't think I can. We're just slightly stuck there. So I like digging out the gold early. Obviously, because, well, we need gold early. Let's make the Chamber of Evilness slightly bigger as best we can. And let's build a little uh, workshop right here into this gold. In order not to make things too easy for Talia, the storytellers had decided to have heroes appear here far from any civilization to attack the dungeon. Story intrinsic logic was something that happened to other people. Okay. Let's get some doors on this. Or maybe we build it out this way. We'll see, but we definitely need a workshop now.
So, okay, so this is built through. So the enemies will have to go through the lava and then through the spiders. And we can also build ourselves a little bit of a merry-go-round here. To really make it a little bit more of a journey for them. To get to our stuff. So we'll fill in this. Spiders will help us at least on one side. Over here we need to fill in some stuff, otherwise it's not gonna work like I'm looking to do. So we'll fill in this, then they go around here. And we fill in this, so they go all around here and into the lava. Basically, and then we fill in this and then they go around through this lava, so... I'm thinking that makes some sense. Let's get that gold here for our lads. Oh, actually, no, we can't really search the gold yet. But we can build our room here, which will take up gold. See how, how neatly I built this? Don't we enjoy this? I personally very much enjoy this. This looks great. Let's get some doors going, especially on the dungeon heart. Eh, maybe double doors. Let's get some doors going on these as well. Over here, and over there. I think we need a bigger horde camp. Not sure everyone actually has a sleeping spot. Oh yes, they come from south. Perfect, they will run into the spiders. That is quite optimal for us. That is quite ideal. And we need to fill in all this so they have a longer way through the lava. Could dig Challenges out this. Medical fighters grew stronger and stronger. In order to defeat them, the leveling evil's creatures had to become even stronger. And build out like that. To say, someone capped the maximum level at 10. The nerve! This was only partially correct. Actually, the demonic Vault of Might offered the ability to raise the maximum level. The secretly leveling its creatures above the maximum level evil immediately tried it out. Oh, yeah, you can bet your sweet Bippy we're going to try that out. How come you only tell us something like that right before the end, just when the final battle is practically about to begin? It's called an Arc of Suspense. <laughs> Couple more of your little catchphrases, and I'll suspend you over a gorge. But whatever, hop to it, little snots. Make some space for a vault. Ah, uh, we need a, <laughs> we need a goblet farm. We for sure need a goblet farm. Where would we put the goblet farm? Hmm. Not. I mean, yeah, through here. So all this will be goblet farm. It's a pretty decent gobbler farm. Let's put in some walls here. Oh, I built a little bit too far out. So we only have one thoroughfare where people or creatures walk through. We for sure need a gobbler farm. We start with nothing in this mission. That is refreshing. So far, I'm almost excited. Okay, now we need to let them build a little bit. Yeah, as I as I thought, we didn't have enough of these. Didn't have enough of space for our troops. We will need these guys, we will need some gnomes for sure. And we should build out 
the temple to Swole. And we can dig out some more gold. How much gold is here? Ah, yeah, very good. What did I just say? We'll need to slow it down a little bit. Concentrate on certain things. Let things happen, you know? Let him cook. Okay, we filled in most of this. How about you go not die? So now the heroes will have to walk through here, basically. They won't go there, so that's fine. But... Your enemies are in the dungeon. Okay, now they come from the other side. I can't pick up this because it's in the spider domain. So these guys will have to walk through all this lava here. And we will have to kind of catch them on one end. Let's go build a really annoying pathway for them. Like, really annoying. Can I? Oh, will this work? <sighs> now it's too close. Okay, we have to do it a little bit different then. Like so. And up here. And through here. And then down like that way. Okay, so now we have to fight. Come here. Let's hope the little bit of training that they have gone through has helped. They are softened up, so... I'm thinking that should be fine. And we'll deselect this gold here. We don't want that captured at the moment. dug into a spider room. Oh, delightful. That is great, actually. It's great for us. Okay, all we need to do now is fill in this. Basically. We'll take care of the rest later. Now, the problem here is it is that these guys aren't actually going to just stay there. These kinds of spider nests, they don't just sit still. Let's build a more extensive gold chamber here. Actually, it doesn't have to be that big. We'll fill some of this back in. Since these are actual spider nests. Oh yeah, oh yeah, okay. Okay, okay, okay. We're gonna be even better here. <laughs> even better. The spiders, they burrow, uh, so we need to keep that a little bit in mind. There are caravans upstairs going around, also something to take care of, maybe. So the way I'm imagining this is basically we open this up, and then the enemy has to go through all this here. Basically. Oh, my boy. Stop it. Okay, now they can fill this in. I don't know where you are going. So all we need to take care of is basically making sure that when the spiders come, 
they don't immediately just walk all over our stuff. Though, again, spiders might not adhere to this pathing. They might just dig through. But we'll try regardless. Let's hope we don't dig into anything bad here. Enemies are in the dungeon. Okay, training is happening. Very good. Okay, we can't get these guys. They cost a lot of evilness. Let's upgrade our snots a little bit more. And get that spurt ability. Okay, so they went through the lava. They're now fighting the spiders. So we could just drop our guys back here. Slightly in the lava. And they will clean up from behind. So we get some of that XP as well. But there comes the spiders. So we'll drop out of that battle and prepare for a fight over here. Instead. But we're working on that. And we'll have to fill in all this. Once that other pathway here is done. You have lost a creature forever. Mm, that's a shame. What did we lose? Where are you going? Why are you here? There's nothing for you here. Unless he's trying to pick up the evilness. That's probably what it was. Okay, we might want to go upstairs now. Let's check out some stuff there to do. The unfocused evil had still not unearthed the rune sockets. It took heart, vowed to do better, and set about finally unearthing them. But that's not what I'm here for. I'm here for achievements. All right. It's gold. payday. There's a few gold ones in there. I don't like that. Where are my little boys? Go kill the back line. Okay. So, Ballista Tower. I'm not too scared of that. Might just go take it. Let's get this boy out. Get some micromanagement in there. The charity organization Petting Dogs and Cats for Armless Children had carelessly sent out a shipment. Pretty oh, can we get that? Even as delivery service, to be honest. Mm -mm. There's a full gold battalion there. I don't think we can get that. But we might be able to get this place. I do have to keep an eye out. Oh, no. Okay, that's... Now that's... Now we can't get that. That's too big. Too big for our britches. So what is that? The stones of finitude are so powerful. For example, this stone of oh hell, you'll find it out for yourself when you place it in a rune socket. Do I have to keep an eye out on down below? K. 
Okay. I'm looking to get these guys. So we need to have a little bit more evilness under our belt. There's a statue. That's good. And some weaker type enemies. Weaker as in no one here is gold level. Your enemies are in the dungeon. Okay, that's the southern entrance. They haven't gotten through the spiders yet. So I shouldn't think that they will get through the spiders now. 145 evilness, what's this? Doable. I would like to take down a camp though. It's a little bit more profitable. Overall. We do have to keep an eye on the spiders, though. Ah, oh, that might be too much there. That might just be too much. I don't think we have the power yet. I think we'll go back down. The old troop of heroes marched across the landscape, dreaming of a great quest and completely unaware of the absolute evil's dungeon. So we'll go down and maybe we can intercept those heroes. From the southern gate. Also, we need to go fight the spiders. But the spiders are going uh, through a way where we want them to go through. That's, that's pretty neat for us. Um, let's do the following. So we can get a wheel, a hamster wheel here. And let us get some traps down that way. Mainly because we want to take care of those spiders coming up all the time now. That is really the main bit. Payday. So okay, everyone is down, which means they will also walk through uh, through the bad stuff, <laughs> which we don't want them to do. We just want them to go fight there. Okay, let's right-click this spider. Yep, that actually works. Okay, you can give focus commands. But it focuses everyone, so... That might actually not be the best thing for us. Oh, would you look at that? The heroes got through. Alright. Kinda not great. Especially since this is taking a little bit longer than expected. So let's go. You want payday anyway? Let's go have payday. There's no healer here to focus. So let's focus on that assassin. And I don't know that thing. That thing and that assassin there. You are a little bit hurt. Let's take you out of the fight. Your army has just decreased in size due to death. Okay, can you guys maybe kill the things I'm designating here? Enemies are in the dungeon. Okay, that's from the north gate. I don't care so much about that. Okay, still not enough evil news to get the uh, gnomes, sadly. But there's some from this fight, so 
Maybe that's enough? No, it isn't. So these guys will have a hell of a time now. But we made the right choices, I think. Let's get this gold out of here. So we can build this into our gauntlet. And confuse the hell out of me, because I won't remember where these walls are supposed to go. So I'll try and put them in right away. Otherwise, I'll be all kinds of confused. Oh, you know, we might leave these out and just build a thresher room instead. Yeah, like that. Do a nice little... This here. And now we add... A bunch of these. Just to help a little bit with it all. <laughs> we'll just fill this in. Uh. Do we go snatch ourselves Don't some evilness? Out. And some XP. Now we can't actually because... We need more faction research, otherwise they are stuck on level 3, so... That's not really sensible for us. Okay, all our gold, mi gold mines are now mined out, so we're going to go on these guys here. And we'll dig a little bit over into this gold here as well. Why does this show up as gold? Oh, it's that. That's what's showing up as gold. Will the heroes win? I shouldn't A think so. Area of the dungeon has been discovered. Oh, nice. Um, the creature makes all targets its 50% more sensitive to fire. Let's give it to one of our goblins. Creature generates 1% of its maximum life energy. So that's a tank for sure. So this guy gets it. And the damage done by the creature is increased by 26%. So that's another goblin there. So here we built a nice little room for something eventually. <laughs> Not sure what we will use it for. But we have it now, so we could, if we would. Okay, we let everything okay. pass above. I didn't think about any of that because I was kind of concerned with what's going on down here. And the heroes are still fighting. Let's clear this up. Oh, okay. Turn around, why don't you? in your dungeon. Uh-huh. Okay, all I wanted is that evilness there. So now we put them all back here. Pick up that evilness because it is... Evilness, thank you. 47, at least. So these guys are coming through now, of course. Let's see, Naga, increase healing beams by 2 meters. Goblins within 5 meters of an orc in ra Berserker Rage deal more damage. Ability to deal more damage at a time. Okay. I think we go here. I believe they can rage... At all times, basically. Like, there, there isn't a limited. You don't really have to research that. 
Let's build a line through here. What the hell kind of room did I build there? Nothing yet. Alright, I just built that wall back in. So we'll just go over here. Pick up all of that gold. I'll have to fill this back in, but that's okay. It's literally just one thing. One thing of gold. Okay. Interesting. So the spiders are kind of through. The enemies are fully through. Well, almost fully. So we'll have to fight them first. That's our priority. Kill the assassins first. Those are usually our bigger problems. And then get that ranger here. This one. Oh, see, they even have a... No, they don't. I thought the little target over the head was... Was ours, but I think that's just their ability. Oh, that makes things a little bit easier. So spiders are getting through. It's only gold spiders, but still. This is, of course, due to our traps not being up to scrap just yet. We definitely need to protect our snods. They need a level up. So they get ignored. Okay, let's stop that. And then we'll dig in through here, fill this back up. By an amazing coincidence, the humanitarian community of altruists collection was passing very close by the dungeon. Stopping it would generate quite a bit of evilness. Okay, they're coming from south. Okay, we, we do need more creatures, honestly. Otherwise, we're going to be a little bit stuck. So let's give them some more space, I think. Right in this direction. I mean, it is 4,000, you know. We can always sell that room later. Once we don't need it anymore. Always upgrade your treasure chamber so they have less walking to do. You can just deposit right there. So someone asked in a different video on a comment why I don't use spells, for example. Like, I leave mana flying all around every time. Well, the reason for that is that I tend to focus my research on one thing. Because evilness is a fairly precious resource, quite honestly. And I don't household very well with it, so... Rather than spread myself between several research trees, I'd rather focus it all on one or two. And if these one or two do not have that kind of stuff, then that's just kind of, you know, a their problem, not so much a me problem. Always take the dryads first. Once the dryad is dead, the trees go down as well. So now the big question is, can we fight whatever is coming there? Or will this be a little bit too much for us? We definitely need the evilness. There's a lot of good creatures also, so... Well, we for sure don't want to fight two things at a time. The transport might be a little bit too big for our britches. Let's fill these traps up a bit more while we wait here. But let's not get taken by surprise. Oh, that's gonna be a... Oh, I don't think we can do that. I don't think we can fight these. We'll 
try. A group of adventurers had met shortly before in a tavern and were now on their way to their first adventure, but they were not aware of the horrible evils nearby dungeon. So we're just gonna try and clean up that back. I mean, this group basically consists of backline. It's really not much else in there. It's all backline. <laughs> They couldn't get to their target, so they were running around in circles there. Okay, more spiders coming in. Okay, that worked out fine. So now we can get these guys. We can upgrade our traps for sure. The snots. Not sure if that was a great idea, but it was an idea. Now we'll just go back down for a moment again. We're not far from our gate, might as well. All oh, right, okay. Very suboptimal here. But I th think the healing is now okay. One of your creatures has died. Oh no. One of our orcs. Ah! Let me select my orc. Select my orc. <laughs> the micromanagement is just not a strength of this game. Okay, we lost all of our orcs, if I saw this correctly. Well, not quite. But plenty, for sure. Okay, that wasn't great. That hurt. That. I mean, we're getting slightly better with those battles, you know, but that was a bad one for, for us. Uh, let's get some... Yeah. Snots for sure. They shouldn't be a problem to the enemy. Um, we'll upgrade... We'll need this eventually. But I think I want some of this. And now we upgrade that. And we upgrade these, so they get their little skill there, and we upgrade that, because we can't afford it and it's fine. And all our creatures are coming back down. Now we put them here. We can also dig on that. It's okay. A lot of gobblers. Ah, camera got stuck for a second. Should we upgrade this room? I think we need more space. The temple of swall. It needs to swell. Basically, let's destroy this door here. Put in a new one, right there. Okay, I think we need... <sighs> Your enemies are in the dungeon. Ah, 
I like cute little alcoves where things are in. Okay. We'll just put our troops here. And we'll want the priestess killed most of everything. So that's taken care of. Now these guys can go through our traps before we engage them. Let's get our troops anyway. The Royal Herald sped through the countryside in a carriage. Stopping him would no doubt bring in quite a bit of evilness. Big upgrade. Okay, that looks neat. Let's go a tick from this end. And target the assassin if we can. Just drop them there. We will intercept that, I'm sure. Will this be our potion room? Maybe. Now, for, for now, we need to pay everyone. That's kind of our bigger problem. Oh, there's some brimstone here. We should probably explode that. We can't get there yet, but we can get through here. So if we dig that way, let's just do that. We can get through all this gold here. And then we can get over to that brimstone there. And now we need to go up. Intercept that caravan. Right there. Is almost exhausted. Wait, that has no guards? Is that supposed to be like that? Or is that a mistake? Let's go get the Frogo. Oh, I think... Is that the current guard? Yeah, okay. All right. We'll meet you downstairs, lads. That's the that's the real issue with escort missions. You just can't trust the escort. Yeah, yeah, they sure are. Okay, I need to build these slightly longer, just ever so slightly longer, so I can fit two of those uh, buzzsaw things there. But that looks okay, I think. Okay, uh, we're gonna go research some mana and some spells so people don't get upset with me. Um, basic potions. Unlocks level 1 basic potions. We should probably have that. Let's upgrade our traps for sure. Since we're here probably for a long time today. Oh yeah, okay. That's, that's a big place that we undug dug out. That's a lot of gold. And a lot of space. 
So these guys are coming in, but they're no longer fighting spiders, really. They're just kind of running through this labyrinthine way. Which this place here was to be, to be filled in. How many thresher traps can we get in this pathway here? Two. Very nice. So they can be greeted properly here. Our snot should be fine now. Okay, let's build a little treasure chamber here. Then we can dig out all this. Huge chamber. Okay, that's looking good in my book. Let our creatures join into the fun. Go for the priestess, everyone, if you can. And then you can just obliterate the enemy. to reorient that it needs to be start a little bit later one of your creatures has bit the dust oh really which of my creatures pray tell oh god we don't have a lot of naga anymore that's a lot of dead naga Some little bit of evilness for us. A gold vein has been mined out. Yeah, yeah, we're working on it. We'll pick up all this gold so they don't have to do all that walking. As you can see, they are not the fastest creatures in this world. We'll sell this room just so they don't start working on putting stuff here and running kilometers for no reason because that would be quite silly can we upgrade our yes we can that's important and we also upgrade this so we can have more boxes and now it's time to build a potion place chamber and I think I want these alcoves again. In your I like building those. They're cute. Okay, but this doesn't work, so we'll have to... One alcove. Two alcove. Okay, not two alcove, because we can't dig in this direction. Not yet. We can do it here. So, whoop. I just like how it looks. It's neat. It's way too big. Like, way, way, way too big. It never needs to be that big. But... Well... Everyone has got their preferences, don't they? Let's build this very, very expensive potion-making room. This is way too expensive potion making room. Okay, you lost a bunch already here, which I appreciate. Look at them going all speedy. And then they end up waiting anyway. All right, where do we put our uh, mana chamber? Do we even have one yet? No, we haven't even researched it. 
So we need to fight these and then we need to go back upstairs again. But we need more Naga. Which we can't afford because we don't have any gold right now. Okay, boys. Sorry, I need to slap you around a little bit. I have to go quicker. Worst treasure chamber ever. Has <laughs> so so many doors. A dream, a dream for thieves. This is what this is. Just getting the hundred gold instantaneously. A little quick boost to the economy. All these little 100 gold squares. They are very handy if you're short on money. A shipment of urgently needed supplies <laughs> have taken a desperate Look at that guy. Which came out very close to the dungeon. He's just or less, the last survivor. To the door free of charge. So, okay, I want to take this brimstone down. But we'll have to make sure that we can absolutely close all that what we're going to open up up again. But I do like that vein of diamonds. Okay. So now we have to build this back in. The distracted evil was, well, distracted. It tried to focus again and set about unearthing the rune sockets for the stones of finitude. So we have to build this back in. Otherwise, they're just gonna walk around our gauntlet. And we don't want that, no, no, sir. Okay, these are all coming from money now. Because <laughs> it's the only place in the dungeon where there is still any to be had. Let's build and dig wildly into this place. Need to make sense. We just need the money. Okay, our wall is back up. And we'll build another treasure chamber here. With even more doors. Which is, fun fact, where the name More Door comes from. And they just built ever more doors. So, where are they coming? Southern Gate is probably our best bet. Wait a moment. I need more Naga. Can I can I get some Naga, please? I mean, even level one Naga better than no Naga at all. So now we can give them some space and just collect some gold for us. Let them do their thing. We have to fight our way forward here. Through this bunch of enemies. Oh, look at that. A statue. Oh, no, 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 no. Please move. Oh, God, no. Oh, God, no. Can you please not stand around? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, God, we are stuck between a rock and a hard place. That's no good. A group of careless heroes march oh, God. through the countryside. Intercepting them would yield a fair amount of evil. Oh, God. Okay, we have to go back. Okay. <laughs> what the hell? Since we're gonna lose a Naga up there, which didn't teleport, I think. God, we lost everything. Almost. Okay, did, 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 didn't work out. Uh, one of those will have to go through without us being able to intercept it. Okay, let's upgrade the works. We need some more power in our army. It's incredibly weak.
So now, hear me out. Could we lead them through this spider nest? I'm pretty sure we could. Payday. We just kind of have to close this up. And this. No. That's not how that works. We dig through here to get that gold. And then we take it away again or something. Trust me, that will make sense. Okay, now we're gonna go back up. Because that shipment is almost there. Oh, great. We run straight. Oh, God, no. Around the underground evil's creatures had discovered one of the no. rune chambers. No. In the center of no, that's two groups. That is two groups. Hand of terror made placing the stone there child's play. Oh, no. Rune chambers, rune sockets, Come on. Non rune stones. Oh, creativity must have gone into overtime there, huh? The frantically button pushing evil God could damn. now place the first stone of finitude in a rune socket and unleash its powers. A stone once placed could no longer be removed. Okay, so it's important to pick the exact bonus we need most right now. Phew, strategic decision. I'm more of a head through the wall person myself. Well, so, just the first thing that comes to mind and on we go. Uh, the stones of finitude provide you with additional benefits when placed in rune sockets. Once inserted, they are okay. Okay. Uh-huh. And how... You can use right-click to drop creatures or objects held in the Hand of Terror. Yes. I'm aware, but how do I pick any of these up? Oh! Stone of Efficiency. Stone of Speed. Stone of Healing. Stone of Experience. Stone of Damage. Uh, we'll just go with the stone of damage. The first stone of finitude was placed and began to shine in the base. Makes your creatures do more damage. <laughs> Great. Wonderful. Then let's move on. I still have something important to do. Why? Do you have another appointment? You betcha. Hello, Thanos. Head, spear. Ring any bells? The stone of damage was now in the damaging evil's arsenal and could be used to strengthen its creatures. Okay, we have a bit of a problem here. The enemy is coming through. I mean, to expect it. To be expected. Okay, cool. Yeah, cool. Let let the assassin live right there. Killing our healers. That's Enemies have entered the dungeon. a good job, ladies and gentlemen. Let's get that mage here. So now they should walk into the spiders. And that's another big, big group there. We'll just go fight from this end, so we fight them right there with our, our with our traps. I hope. Okay, no one died for once. Get that evilness into that evilness vault. Okay, 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 okay. Alright, 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 alright. What's next? Healing range? Sure. Effect of he healing by? Yep. Definitely can use that. So 
So is this not permanently gone from our arsenal of snots? I think so. Oh no, we have that room. Oh wait, we can build that. We can build a mana vault. Let's do that. Build a mana vault. Uh, there. Just build it here. Ding dong! It's payday. And we'll do a little bit of a cute alcove thing again. I'm really having way too much fun just building the dungeon. And that's always been the best part of these games. Alcove. Alcove, Alcove. So now we just need to fetch all that mana that's lying around here. So they don't have to run so much. And I think we can sell this treasure chamber too. Always nice to have a little bit of a central treasure chamber where they can get for better, easier access. Ah, let's clean this up. Enemies have entered the dungeon. I think I should build more traps south, honestly. They, this is This is the bigger problem. Of everything we have here. There's definitely way less in defensive things going on here than elsewhere. The north is probably fine, more or less. Okay, we can connect this room up like that, and then we can fill in all that, make it safe from the outsiders. From potential invaders. A shipment of chandeliers was passing through the area with an unbearable dazzle. The blackest evil would soon plunge that shipment into darkness. I mean, I would love to, but I really need to get a grip and handle on all these enemies constantly running through my home. It's really what I need to do first. Give me that evilness. Straight into the veins. I mean, might as well build the three. And here we go, fight them again while they are on the traps. And let's click this. this. Stone of the attacking power of the destructive evil's creatures. Okay. Oh, 
Not quite sure how effective that was. Okay, what did I want to upgrade? This, but we already have that. This, honestly. It's kind of what we need next. But this is also very enticing. Goblins, debilitating when no lowest physical resistance. All these are very, very interesting. Honestly, I think we leave it open for a little while longer. Let our creatures rest. Heal them nicely. Look at that, it goes so quick with the updates. The upgrade. It's just insane. And now we can try again to maybe push out and collect some evilness from the overworld. We definitely need to increase our horde faction research. Oh, let's get that. Yes, basic potions. Very good. It's payday. I mean, we already have a whole bunch here, but might as well get something more. Don't really want to fight that tower, but I think we can do it. Let's give him speed. Which is also attack speed. Well, we're not going to go in there. Just kind of open it up. What we do want is evilness from that caravan coming. A small convivial troop of heroes marched okay. across the landscape, dreaming of a great quest. We'll go fight these this time. Aware of the absolute evil's dungeon. The power of this stone of finitude strengthened all of the creature's attacking power. One of your creatures has died. Will we be able to do this? Yes. I don't know what we lost. I think it was a gnome. So that's a lot of evilness that we got there. Now we can upgrade this. Healing beam can spread. Upgrade them. Our backbone needs to be strengthened. Let's pick up that little droplet of evilness there. Oh, wait. Let's heal up. We would. These guys never stop. They just keep moving. Just gonna keep dropping them health po health potions here. I don't even think we need to. Looks fine, yeah. Okay, very good. Well done, everyone. Let's go close here, pull them out. We don't want to fight them under the turret. Get this going. Get some more speed going. Get this going because I don't think it costs us anything. To have that up. So we cleared them out. Now we can go clear that thing out.
We really have no range in this army. Let's go take on the hero's hall. So we finally managed to take something down up here. Like, does this stack or what? The power of this stone of finitude strengthened the injurious evil's creatures and oh. viewed their blows with more oomph. Okay, so he has 43 damage right now. The stone of finitude strengthened the attacking power of the destructive evil's okay. creatures. I don't think it stacks or anything, so... Don't need to spam this. Oh, Defend good God. The dungeon heart. Whoops. Okay, let's go some faction research here so we can start building into this thing. And get us some heroes going. And where would we have that? Here? I think so. Like this whole thing will be that. And we'll build some alcoves. We'll always have a room for alcoves. The best coves are alcoves. <laughs> Got there more enemies? No, but we definitely need to build more traps. Now, build this out a little bit further. Just ever so slightly. So I can build two of those in a row. This is the same problem here as well. I think so. I always build them Enemy one short, the it appears. Okay. What did we lose again? Shouldn't have bought two. Do we even still have gold anywhere to be mined? Oh, we got that one vein there. Ah, we have some gold veins here. So we can get all that going. Though that is not a lot, I don't think. Now I can fit some. That's nice. I'm always so eager to pick up the gold that I start carving out more walls instead of getting any of the gold. I'm a little bit disappointed in myself every single time it happens. Like, I should be able to do this by now, shouldn't we? So this is a very nice, stress-free mission. Like, not that it doesn't have a challenge or anything, but... I'm not constantly worried about what's happening next, about the thing that's gonna kill us in a moment, you know? So that's very... I appreciate that a lot. That's that's very nice. It's a nice change of pace with the past few missions. Okay, I think this army down there will be fine. So we'll go back in the overworld and clean up some more. Go clean this up, maybe. And build more traps down here. Whoop. Uh, 
Okay, they don't want to attack this. Look at all this. Got an artifact and everything. I didn't even know you could have artifacts in there. Okay, let's give them some speed here. I got a little goblins cleaning up there. Wait, pick the evil. God, I was scared for a second because I saw this dude walking very nonchalantly into that one big room, which I thought was closed off. Okay, very good. Now we could go and try take down one of those creatures. Let's be careful though with walking around here because I do tend to run into things that I didn't clear out beforehand. And then I get sad. Let's build up this. Payday. Creatures are collecting their pay. What good creature is here? Oh, the tavern. Okay, that's fine. Let's take these out first. Fine, we can take a little bit of that. Oh god. Here I thought we could take a little bit of damage, but that's not a little bit of damage that thing deals. Okay, there's one assassin walking around. Intercept construction crew. Have completely mined out a gold vein. Yeah, I bet they have. There are enemies in your dungeon. There are. But if you can believe it, we actually managed to build a gauntlet now that kills the enemy. So now we just need to get to more gold here. Oh, look at that. There's some right there. Very good. Can you guys not pointlessly stand around there, maybe? Just actually do something. construction crew set out to rebuild the destroyed hero building. Okay, so we have to go here, basically. Which should be fine. I don't think anything will stand in our way there. There's no, sp no more spiders in our gauntlet, but that's okay. This thing here is looking much better as well. A little treasure chamber around here. One of your creatures has bit the dust. Oh, so much for that. Okay, I think we ran into a patrol. Oh no. That must have been a patrol. So what did we lose? A bunch of orcs, what we lost. Well, I don't like that. <laughs> I can tell you. Let's get some spells researched, shall we? Let's get this researched. So we'll fight both of these, which we cannot afford to do. 
We'll just kind of poke them a little bit. Like they will kill us. If we if we fight both at the same time, they will kill us. Look at how much damage we're getting just from one group. I know we have to go back down and regroup. Okay, we're losing out on these two. I know my limits. And these are some of them. Alright, upgrade our boys. Quarry Greystone. Even better potions. Let's upgrade all these indestructible. Uh, that's okay. Yeah, we can't fight that. Not with what we have. Which is very little. Can't even afford it all that more. It's crazy. Okay, we wanted to build this thing. And we wanted to go big. Which we... Surprise, surprise. Cannot actually afford, but we'll do it. Or we'll try anyway. Alcoves for the win. There's another brimstone we could take out. We need more Naga because those are also a little bit dead. I think we can sell this treasure chamber. And make more room for horde creatures. should not be interested in us not here I don't think but we're in a bit of a financial pickle now I'll we'll have to dig this out so now we can open this up again we close this and that way we get access to all this gold Which we kind of need. Just build a little door there. And we can just put them around there. It's also fine. And then we can close all that. And build a doorway through here. Basically. Once this army is done anyway. I wish this slime trap had a little bit of a slowdown. Like a... A thing that, you know, holds for a bit. I don't think it does that. Does it? I mean, for 11 seconds. So if we put... If we put a slow... Here, maybe they get slowed into the lava. Well, I don't like that. That's not how I wanted this to be. Or did I? <laughs> I don't quite remember. We'll just put a few slows so they maybe get slowed through the lava. I mean, it looks like it's holding longer, so... We'll have to see. Which, of course, would be a big problem because I never saw that. Speaking of big problem because I never saw that. Oh, God. Am I utterly blind? I swear. 
I think I'm a I just might be utterly blind. Sometimes feels like I am. No. More training for you guys. Can't waste you at this moment. Traps will have to deal with the enemies. So the mana is full. No one's working on that anymore. Potions are kind of good. Though they are working on that still. Let's build some doors to increase efficiency of that room. And maybe here as well. I don't know exactly what the efficiency of that room is, but... I know doors are good for us. Okay, and now we build through here. It's payday. Which allows to open this up. Or close this up rather. Will the enemy notice and turn around? I don't think Enemies so. Have entered the dungeon. Okay, we're gonna go fight them back here. I don't want the wheel to trigger for that one assassin. Very good. Our creatures did their duty. All right, that looks pretty good. That looks like we got a bunch of people right there. Let's throw some uh, bats at them as well. So there's more gold here for us, but we can't quite dig it out yet. Okay, we're working a lot of traps and doors, so that slows down our snots from working on the things that we want them to work on, which is gold. So this again is a is a problem of my own making. Let's kill these. Ha ha, you Harry shot too short. Cake for the poor express was whizzing by near the dungeon. Would the diabetic evil let it just do that? I don't really have much of a choice, really. I need to wait for a gold. There's some gold we could insta mine. Can I turn this room off? Can I turn certain cauldrons off or anything? I mean, we could sell cauldrons for sure, but that does not feel right. 
So these guys are, of course, very slowly replenishing. We need to upgrade them so they can teleport. For which we need, you guessed it, more gold. We could also upgrade here to get more of them. For which we need, you guessed it, gold. Which we can't really get. Because we have too many things happening waiting for them to be done. So all of this is my fault. Uh, let's go. Nah, our army isn't big enough to go upstairs. Not big, not strong enough. What to do, what to do. Okay, now some of them are working on gold again. Come on, lads, quicker. That's the main problem with our very, very long defensive structures here. Like, we don't need this. This doesn't help us at all. In fact, this slows down things a little bit. Not that it matters much for, uh, for us not here. Enemies are in the dungeon. I mean, it's almost positive. That means that they are working on the gold, right? What the hell is all this? What is that? Okay. <laughs> the physics on the boxes is just kind of insane. They go everywhere. There's more gold to be had here, but we can't dig into that yet. So they keep replenishing the traps. So all we really can do is try and kill the enemy. Before they trigger too many traps. But every potion you use is probably also an issue, kinda. Well, there's a real big dryad in there. Can I pick that real big Dryad up? If I drop these here, will they stay there? Will they stay frozen or will they go away? We'll see, we don't have a graveyard where they could put them, so I have a feeling that they might just stay there. Until their time has come. We'll just pick everyone and put them all there. Okay. Shall we try and intercept some stuff upstairs? I'm a little bit scared, as you can tell, because I don't get gold at the moment. And I won't be for a little while longer, due to my very own choices, I'm quite aware. Oh wait, no, these guys are already ahead, aren't they? Yeah, you can hear them tippy-tapping along here. Let's try and catch up. Of course, the Naga always a little bit slower than everyone else. What the hell was that? Not what I wanted is what it was. Your little snots have completely mined out a gold vein. Can I have to fight through this army there? And I don't think we're gonna catch them because there's probably more between us and them. Yeah. Not catching them. And there goes some of our gnomes again. Uh, 
And some of our Naga are dying. I need to be better at micromanaging this stuff. These deaths are all due through me because I don't I don't pay attention enough for this. Alright, we have to go back down. This is this is horrible. <laughs> We have to hide behind our traps like cowards. Okay, but it looks like the enemies might stay frozen here. So we can just keep them around. I hope. But for now we really only have to wait until we get some money. Uh, honestly, we could just magic us some money. Enemies are in the dungeon. It'll be an arduous process, but it's better than nothing. Which we're currently getting. Nothing. I want the cooldown on this. Okay, and then just someone runs right in here, and that doesn't help us either. Okay, let's build this through. Fill this up. And fill this up. There's another trap there. Payday! Creatures are collecting their pay. Enemies have yeah. entered the dungeon. We're not fighting. Not manually, not directly anyway. And of course it's payday now, so that's very suboptimal. But at least I think slowly we're getting places. So what they need to do now is to replace traps. We need to desperately upgrade this. To level six but we need to oh god hmm. so the only way i can see to speed this up is cancel all these why does this get us evilness Do these things cost us evilness? Must be. So we cancelled all these. We're good on that now. If we don't use potions for a while, and those will run out. So that'll be fine. can just drop these in here. Okay, let's kill that assassin there. He's gonna put a lot of strain on our trap infrastructure here. And same on this side. I'm gonna fight what is left here. So there are a few traps left to be taken care of. And they are finally working on them. Which I will take as a good sign. Can't pick up this. Now I can. Let's see them being thrown throughout every place in this dungeon. And I swear I knew it would be a long mission. But this is kind of horrible and due to my own failures. <laughs> Oh god, this is taking forever again. Right. What are you even doing? Like, they they get it for a second and then run away. It's not management and this is... Are they? 
Did he just go here? How will I ever get the research up playing like this? Some money is coming in now. That's nice. Traps are being built. Now oh, don't wave at me. Build. It's very cute that they wave at you, but... I don't need that. I need that stuff built. I'll just drop him here. I don't know what his next job is, but I feel like that's helping him. Enemies have entered the dungeon. What are you guys doing? Something's wrong with their AI. Something is weird. Look at that. Like I keep picking up these boxes here. Why? Okay, I think it's helping. Yeah, now they're longer in the lava. And lava doesn't cost us anything, so... This is a cost-efficient way of helping murdering our enemies. Oh, I love it when they kind of re reorganize and they're like, No, we can't leave our buddies behind. Accountability buddies, we need to walk together. And then there's all these random boxes lying around. Okay, I think we're we're back to a somewhat working economy. Uh, first things first, we'll upgrade these guys further. So now they can dig through Greystone, which is important for us because we need that gold here. So we can dig out all that. We've got to be a little bit careful. We don't want the enemy to figure, oh, look, we can just walk through here. What is with all Your these traps? Dug into a spider nest. Uh, boxes, not traps. Okay, that's a problem and not. Both, kind of, because look at that. That's great for us. Finally, a little cash infusion right there. Very good. So now we can upgrade that and we can upgrade this not. So that'll do a whole lot for us. Upgrade the traps, also going to do a lot for us. Upgrade them more? No. Yes. We need higher level on these. Upgrade them more. Goblins a bit in uh, yeah, physical resistance down. Increase capacity per tile, no. We don't want that. We have too much as it is anyway. So now let's get some new creatures in here. Zero gnomes. A construction crew set out to rebuild the destroyed hero buildings. Yeah, I don't care. Let them. And we'll build this into a new creature hall. Or in an expansion of the creature hall. Okay, that is a bit of a problem right there. They are getting through marvelously. Okay, so now we can try and do this again. We'll just build the ones that are green for us. So alcoves first. 
And now we go clean this out. So our guys get a little bit of a boost. Let's help them a little bit. Speed this along. Did I get a level one orc? Apparently. So we can't really get any heroes in here. Might as well ourselves take Enemies care of this. The we got this nonsense again. Two assassins here. Okay, can we build another one? No. We'll be a little bit more prudent about this stuff now. I'm not just gonna build all willy nilly. Randomly. Stack. Like crazy. To make sure what we do is affordable and sustainable. Alright. I think we're good on most of these rooms. Could do a little bit of faction the research. Is almost exhausted. Is this going well? Yeah, it looks to be. We're getting a nice little bit of experience here. Another bit of sulfur. Or brimstone, rather. Let's see what we can uncover, exploding that. And these guys will just go, I don't know, back. <laughs> Somewhere here, go train. It's just all these exploding boxes still everywhere. <sighs> I don't know how they get back here. I really don't understand it. A new area in the oh, goody. Thank you very much for that. That is some good it's stuff. Payday. A payday I'm not afraid of for once. New things are happening. Alright, so we can build more of these now, I'm sure. Look, green! Green! Oh. Okay, so now we take the real good ones. So, this one. And this forest blade lad. And then this wizard guy here also. Once he's dead. Let's go take care of these guys. With our army from here. Your little snots are completely mined out of gold vein. A speed boost. Very good. That is looking up now. Let's get all these folk. Throw them in here so we have our pick at the end. Honestly, we might as well pick up some of the lures and just throw them into the lava pit. So I have a new idea here. I want to build like so. And then kind of through here. Send them out like that. The only reason being I want to fill this in. So we'll take these down. It, it's not really helping much. Like that little bit of lava there is not going to change anything. 
But I do want to be able to mine out all this gold here. So, we'll need to be able to... Uh, we're not able to fill that in. Uh, okay. That's not working the way I wanted to. Ah, well, it doesn't matter. <laughs> it's fine. Enemies have entered the dungeon. Let's build some more traps since we can afford it again. Fine. It's all good. Where's the brimstone here? There might not even be any. Let's just dig through, put something more in the socket there. It's a big swamp with nothing in it. Yeah, so this is working kind of nicely now. I appreciate that. Look at that goat lad. Going all quick. Alright, let's build some more here as well. Just so we're sure. And let's get some more of these going. So I want that wizard. That big wizard there. Let me pick up that archmage. And this forest blade. And now we get some more of these in here. Only the ones we can afford. No building ahead of ourselves. I mean, beside the priestess and the warrior, I think we can get everything else out. Like, the warrior can stay. The rest goes up in the lava pit. Payday. Trash. Trash is what they are. And the warriors are actually pretty, pretty, pretty good. Let's go fight a bit. Let them earn their payday. And we can pick another stone in here, so... Which one? Stone of experience. Stone of healing, maybe. The second stone of finitude had been placed. Only three more stones waited to take. Oh, the okay. Place. We can switch the between them. Manifested its power to the healing evil. From now on, it could cheerfully have its creatures regenerate. Okay. Sounds good to me, honestly. Okay, we're gonna just pick up everyone. And then we sort them out in the crypt. So, this arrow forest, this forest blade, and all these priestesses basically. That's what we want. A little bit are in the difficult to select them actually. Okay, the rest can go away. All into the lava pits. I think we're good on the traps now. 
I think. So let's venture up, maybe? I'm not too sure on this end, but... That should be okay, shouldn't it? Like we can make a little treasure room here. Let's do that, maybe. Ease my mind. I like the lava splash when you throw them in. <laughs> okay, so who next? I think we'll get some priestesses. They are not the best we got here in terms of power level or anything. But they're going to help us the most with our army. Another green one. And another green one. And another green one. Oh, we can afford a bunch right now. Oh, there are some Dryads, but they're kind of low level. This war rider here would be more interesting, maybe. This Let's switch to damage again. The creature's attacking power. I'll just go wipe this out from behind. <laughs> Oh, there's a high level Dryad. That's nice. Let's wipe that out as well. And we got the Wall Rider, which we'll keep. A small convivial troop of heroes marched across the landscape, dreaming of a great quest. I think we can go up. Completely unaware of the absolute evil danger. <laughs> I think with the hero ghosts, we're kind of good now. And where's that Dryad? There. I hope nothing attacks us here. This looks fine. This doesn't look fine. Payday. Creatures are collecting their Adam's yeah, warriors are crazy. All right, I think that was the hero troop. So now we go destroy that thing again. Has bit the dust. Okay. I think we'll get this restoration unit now. Honestly. Seventy-five of enemy armies ignored. Yep. Yeah. Take it. Sure. Okay. Let's get us some more healers. A Dryad. The Wall Rider. Okay, let's get the Reviver Chamber. Which, that is not what it's called, I'm aware, but we're gonna call it that way anyway. Okay, these guys upstairs are fine. Took care of everything here. Good stuff. And
And downstairs, I think the enemies are dying nicely as well. So now we can build this thing here. And get these up. Okay, half our army is just kind of standing around. Oh, I think that, that might have been the people that died. So we're going to put them all together right there. I hope. Why do they keep running and throwing these things around? That's just... I don't know. It's a little bit annoying. Okay, everyone, let's go take out this thing. That's really not how I hoped this election would go. Okay, goodbye. Come on, just kill it. Nice. Okay. More enemies. Popped out of it. So now we go kill that room. That place down here. And we're gonna put a warrior in there. Can we build more? Yes. Okay, is that 11? I don't know. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Yeah, okay. We should be fine. Alright, let's upgrade Horde. Let's upgrade Undead. Let's upgrade... Here, more Snots. Let's upgrade Demon a little bit. Upgrade this. Okay. I think now we're slowly getting into it. Let's go back down one more time. We are well defended here. That's not a problem. But I want to gather everyone together again, basically. And we might go get that forest blade. Who's just walking through all of our stuff and not dying. Enjoy my whole army. Oh, he might just kill the whole army. All by him lonesome. Let's go take care of these guys as well. And this guy can become a friend. Right there. Yeah, 
Okay. Ah, uh, we need a brewery. This? This will be our brewery. We don't know. We don't need much of it. I think. And yes, you guessed it. Alcove time. We don't need much of it, he says. And then builds a huge room for it anyway. Can't help myself. Come on. Get in there. Get in there. Yeah, you can do it. Well done, lads. We'll just put two kettles in. That'll have to do. This we need to upgrade one more. 280. I mean, look at this. It's kind of insane. Do we have plague yet? No. Jesus. How many are there? Okay, we're just gonna go fight them here, maybe. Let's see. Let's see if we survive this. Yeah, okay. That worked out. Wonderful tinder for an evil fire. Oh, I had, I had the absolute evil summon for. Oops. That wasn't exactly what I wanted to do. Yeah, they're demanding beer now, so they will lag behind. The ones demonstrating. Can't be helped, I suppose. I mean, I am working on it. We are getting there. Could you heal up? One of your creatures is furious and is on strike. There comes the healing. Now we should be able to fight the garrison and whatever is coming there. Can we increase efficiency of this thing? I mean, yeah, kinda. What does this help? Undead heroes now do cold damage. I think I... Let's upgrade the horde a little bit further first. Increase capacity. I don't know if I want to increase capacity, honestly. Let's definitely increase capacity on the gold. That's for sure. That we can use. Let's there look are at that. in your dungeon. Oh, I didn't upgrade the traps, did I? No, I didn't. Ding dong, it's payday. So the problem with these slow creatures now is that they might run into an enemy that's coming from behind. just create some beer out of thin air. Fuck. 
does that help them? No. Okay, we'll just try and gather everyone here. I mean, they do use it. Okay, it looks like we given them enough. I think they're good now. Well. Enemies have entered the dungeon. I think we need some better spells. Okay, I wanted to upgrade traps. Clicked it. Done it. Did it. Okay, let's upgrade these fully. So, orc boys are the best orc boys they can be. Okay, they're no longer part of group one for some reason. Not sure why. Because they're different units now? Is that how it goes? Okay, let's go back. Let's get together. Let's get some speed. And then we'll go get that shipment. Stop that rebuild. Basically is what I want. What do we have here? A bunch of wizards. Let's just get a bunch of wizards. Why not? I like wizards. Wizards are cool. Okay, we should try and dig toward the next thing, but there are spiders. I can hear them already. We'll just dig a long way down here. And see what happens. I would like you to not rebuild, please. Oh god, that's all ranged. The whole army is ranged. <laughs> okay. Sometimes silly stuff like this happens. So what I want next is vampires, because we need someone healing our undead there. They're very expensive, apparently. There we go. Oh. Big enemy party coming. Will they fight on their own? Big question. We'll see. I think we're losing a bunch of stuff there. Can we get this, please? Thank you. I also wanted better spells, but... I think we have to contend with what we got at the moment. And then we go back down, pick up the rest of our army. Let everyone heal up a little bit. I mean, we're right next to the to the dungeon. Might as well. 
Then we can go clean up from the north. What's going on up here? Digging all that out. Just trying to get there. There's definitely something here that we're going to unearth. So, let's get everyone back in here. Better spells. Succubi we don't need. We need this. We need that. We need these two for sure. So the vampire queens are going to be happy. I just will build some room for it as well. Right away. We'll just excavate all this. That'll be the graveyard and that'll be the dance hall. Like so. Right now, I don't think we're even getting any gold anywhere, really. A princess whose pumpkin carriage was being repaired sped along near the dungeon. Would the fairy tale hating evil sit there idly and allow this to happen? Okay, here we have a little bit of gold left, but not much because they have to walk all the way all the time. Let's make it a little bit more efficient for them. So they need to run so far to drop off this gold there. I thought this was an easy quick mission. Well, I thought it was a fun mission. It is. So far. But boy, am I taking forever or what? Don't answer me, I know. I know the answer. Why can't I get this? I could... Have appeared in your dungeon. Yeah, they would. Everyone, greet our little goopy guests. Do we have more room in here? Maybe. No, we can't fit more. Could, of course, make more room, but I think that's fine. We're pretty decent on this end now. Your little snots have discovered an artifact. Oh, good. This I like more, honestly, than the artifact. But what is it? Spits out some evilness. The bonus -grabbing evil that's good. Stored an artifact in order to unleash its powers. That actually helps us a bit. Wait, so there's one there. Could there be another one around this thing? If you just kind of dig in there. Nah, we would have seen it. There's nothing here. So can I get this now? No? Okay, let's build the graveyard first. Let's start with that. The problem with the graveyard, in my opinion, is that the Sons do just start bringing stuff there all the darn time. And with the way I build my stuff, that's a little bit unfortunate, to say the least. Let's get some Vampire Queens going. Maybe not that many. Get some more gnomes in there. Another Naga? quite know what our setup should be. That's ah, fine. Oh, look at that. Another big one. In the dungeon. Nice. I don't mind so much that our enemies are in the dungeon, but let's go clear them out regardless. I mean, we are right there. Might as well. Completely obliterated. No, I don't want to. I don't want to dig this stuff. I wanted to pick. Are you kidding me? I can't deselect it. I should, uh, I 
Okay, I haven't researched the temple or the dance hall yet. But now we can research the temple and the dance hall. Nice. That's like bad for us in terms of money spent efficiency, but it's kind of good for us. <sighs> Not big enough. Okay. Then we'll just build out in this direction. Here. There's spiders. I can hear them. But such is life. Oh boy. Okay now. At least that'll give us all kinds of XP for the Vampire Queens. So bright side, I suppose. And it's almost already fully cleared out. There's some more spiders there. Okay, uh, I just wanted to build a little temple here. So build this. And then we build the temple thing. Where it is? There it is. And then this here is going to be the dance hall. Sorry, lads. Gotta deal with this first. And now we can put another artifact. Doesn't really matter because we're constantly on the damage one anyway. Stone of efficiency. The third stone of finitude was placed. Two more stones needed to be placed. The stone of efficiency was now at the effective evil's disposal. From now on, its runes would be able to work much more effectively. Can the undead train yet? No, we cannot. I need that. Um. A construction crew was on its way right. to repair and rebuild the destroyed hero structures. There's brimstone here, so I have a feeling there might be something hidden there. So we're gonna go take it out. Figure out what that might be. And we'll build a dance hall here, so they don't get angry. You don't want angry undead on your hands, do you? I sure won't. Come on, what's in there? Your little okay. Dug up a spider. More spiders, but also more money. Which I appreciate. I mean, spiders do directly translate into experience points, so... At this point, our army is strong enough to deal with this kind of stuff. I don't worry too much about it anymore. There we go. And now we go upstairs. Try and intercept that thing. I mean, look at that army. Look at them. Get a, a little bit of a speed bump. Enemies have entered the dungeon. I don't quite know where we have gone yet. And where it's safe to go. All right, why can't I upgrade these? Not enough evilness. Let's upgrade the Naga to Naga Champions. Which we then have to, I assume, put back into their group. So at this point with our Traps all being fully upgraded. I don't worry too much anymore. But that stuff. Okay, fine. Let's let's take out the sheep. I can see that you would like to do that. Let's let's go. Enjoy. And the barrel.
Release the tower. Efficiency. Ah, we're 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 good. We got plenty of beer now. Should be no more striking. We're just waiting for this. Okay, now you can go. Creatures are collecting their pay. Still not enough evilness. Level two complex potions. Look at that enemy army. Let's upgrade to complex spells. Get us some shielding in here. I will switch to damage. Oh, damage. That is ridiculous. That is one healer, I think. One high priestess in the back here. That's keeping all these alive. A single healer. Kept all these going. Okay, now. Where are my assassins? Okay, I can't add them to... Oh, no. Everyone, please. Don't be fools now. Let's kill that turret. And kill that thing. Then kill these people. Assassins on the back line. Take out the healers. Then go take out the turret. Alright. Okay, uh, more faction research. Let's push the horde. Nicely done. And we'll just go clear out everything up here now. And there is another vein of diamonds. Very good. So we can clear out all this. Well, a little bit of a treasure chamber right there, so they don't run all weird and odd places. Could you also join, please? Oh god, that's a whole big city there to take out. Right. Okay, yeah, traps looks okay. Can't upgrade them any further anyhow. Let's upgrade this a little bit more so we have more snots working for us in the background. Are in the Enemies in the dungeon still looks okay, but we might add a few more traps right there. I'm thinking... Just really doubled down on this stuff. Build another wheel trap there. I mean, don't think anything gets through anymore, but... Why risk it? 
when we can easily offset those risks. Oh, look, a small group. Honestly, this one goat rider, he will never arrive. I always... It's, it's the way I attack move, basically. That's why he's just stuck down there. Or there are actual limits to how many creatures you can have in a selection. Which would be news to me. Okay, let's upgrade these guys to goblin champions, maybe? No. <laughs> Faction research. That needs to happen. Okay, everyone. Just go take it out. Very good. I'm just gonna use move commands, but this thing here is just not moving. Why are you not moving? Okay, I lost a lost a bunch of creatures there. But they will be revived. Fret not. Interesting enough, I don't have all these many difficulties down here with things dying. Payday. Or rather not dying. Alright. Let's get some more here as well. No reason not to. Oh, I think I got the traps a little bit lopsided there. Ah. Uh. Okay, so if you have a group, if you have creatures of a group, you have bound underground, even if they're dead, and you have your army upstairs, and if you, you, you can double press that button to jump to your army. So you can press, for example, you know, um, double tap one, if that's where you bound your group, yeah? That's what I keep doing. But then suddenly I have something underground and then that's what's going to be picked up. It's very irritating. <laughs> okay, faction research 10. Let's push the undead as well first. Because we actually do have undead. Might as well push them, yeah. Pick up some of this stuff here. You never know what's in there. Might be something good. Okay, now. We keep going. Oh, actually. I don't want to do speed on them. Not when they're so disjointed. A shipment of urgently needed supplies had taken a desperate shortcut, which came out very close to the dungeon. More or less evilness delivered right to the door free of charge. Your enemies are in the dungeon. Okay. Let's see if this works how I hope it does. Let's get our friend Beelzebub up here. Maybe even get Gorgor in there, I think. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff down here. Let's just get him to help. Okay, but we're f doing fairly well. Where is he? Come on, lad. Uh, you go kill this thing. You guys kill this thing. Underground is still looking fine. Nothing really we need to do. We 
to use him as long as we have him. Which usually isn't very long. But it's kind of nice to have him. Look at all these lads. <laughs> Poor boys. So I'd rather attack the enemy as they stand there. Rather than are in the throw him at the buildings. Because the buildings we can take down our own. Did you just die there? No. You just kind of fell over. Understandable. Nine. We're getting there. I was just pushing faction research. I'm done with making sensible choices. We're just trying to get this done. With maybe an achievement or two. I don't know if the dungeon research factors into the faction research. But since it might, we're just going to push that as well. And now we attack this froggy. Okay, we're, we're back to zero gold. We're back to that issue. So we'll just go dig in the direction of the other thing here, which there's more spiders in there, as you can hear. Okay, we killed the frog. Wait a moment. You pick that up. You don't come back here without bringing that in. And since we're right close to the dungeon entrance, we're just going to go down, deal with the spiders that we're inevitably going to dig up here. And then we're going to go... Dig all the way through here as well. Like we don't have to place them. You know, we just have to get there. That's fine. You can deal with that. A spider room. Yep. And all of our troops are almost back home. Almost. 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 There we go. Now you guys get this. And you get a speed potion. And you can just rip through all these spiders here. Honestly, because this is gonna bug me, we're just gonna start right in the back here. Get them a shield. Get them a bit of strength. Now we're gonna go ahead and use this spell here. And the digging evil's creatures have discovered Get some another room gold in there. In the underground. Enemies have entered the dungeon. So now when they want to go back home, they have to fight their way through all this. Basically. That's what I'm thinking. Another diamond vein. Nice. Be sure like that. Your little snots have discovered an artifact. And we can just add some more gold here with our spells. It's not too much, but it's also not nothing. Another artifact, eh? Spits out... What is that? It gives us gobblers. The bonus grabbing evil had stored an artifact okay. in order to unleash its powers. So we'll just throw that in there. I don't really care. The fourth stone of finitude was in place. Only one more stone had to be placed before the gauntlet could be charged. Wait a minute. What do you mean? Could be charged. I think it's better if you just wait and see. Okay. Ah, Level 10. That does not bode well. We'll just push this as far as we can. Was now ready for use. 
The wise evil could use it to have its creatures level up even faster. Another rune chamber has been discovered. The what chamber? Oh god, no. Okay, wait, we have to deal with that first. Before we go up here and have more adventures, we have to take care of these. That's gonna be a big annoyance for us if we don't. We'll just thunderclap them, pull them down for a second so our troops can regenerate. There's some more brimstone. Always take the brimstone. You never know what you get. Okay, we're not going to slot that in just now because we're not done with the faction research, but we're getting near. So we're just going to go up here with everyone. Select everyone again. Make sure they're all on the right shortcut. And then we're just going to go take out some of that good goody goodness here. In hopes of not running into anyone. Okay. Almost three hours on this mission. But this is what I get for wanting to get the achievements. Or wanting to try anyway. At least that. You know what would be horrible for me? If I looked over on my recording software right now. And I saw that I didn't actually record anything the whole time. I think I would just quit forever. <laughs> Never touch the game ever again. Which of course is quite unfair to the game, but what can you do? Okay, let's upgrade this to 10 because then we get another snot out of it. Alright, everyone. Not so much lacking for evilness anymore. We're mainly lacking for money. I don't care. I'm just gonna fight. I think it. Oh, okay. I do care. I do care. Where did these guys come? Oh, God. We did. Hello? Can I do this? We are so dead. What the hell? Where did they come from? Here? Oh god. That could have been it. Come on, buddy. Attack. Send him next there. Goodness. So evilness is not our problem right here. Our problem is gold. We're not going to research anything else. But there's more brimstone here. Wait, is that gold or brimstone? There are enemies in your dungeon. Ugh. Again and again. Alright, go and kill this thing. The army will follow you in that direction. A new area has been unearthed in the dungeon. I think Thunderclap is one of the best spells out there. Really helps you get the upper hand. Okay. Let's get that hero camp done.
gotta bite through that hammer. Now we go into this army because otherwise all these little fools here, like this guy, they're just gonna die immediately. Oh look, Grandalf. Good stuff. Yeah, they immediately die. Good stuff, good stuff. Your gold vein is nearly exhausted. Okay, everyone. Uh, let's go gather right there. Just gather there. Let's just do that. What do we have active? Damage. Let's get for the, the healing a little bit. Of now allow the regenerating evil's creatures to slowly, well, you know, regenerate. Still some gold for us to dig out here. Not much. They, they still bring these boxes here. I, what is this? What are you doing? Why are you bringing these boxes here? What is wrong with you? Why do you keep doing this? What happened? What went wrong in your childhood? I don't even want to know how many snots we're losing to constantly trying to get boxes there. What is this? Like, there's nothing there. What are they doing? Look at this nonsense. Like, are they just kind of offering these as, as sacrifices or something? I don't know. It is baffling. Okay, uh, since we're right next to the entrance, we'll bring these guys up as well. So now everyone, please come together. And we have zero gold again because payday. And our snots are doing everything but what they're supposed to. Okay, listen, we have to, we have to destroy these. We have to destroy these, we have to stop. We have to stop with the boxes. We have to stop. This could severely destroy us. But I think that's like one of the issues here. The charity organization Petting Dogs and Cats for Armless Children had carelessly sent out a shipment. Pretty much an evenness delivery service, to be honest. Okay, luckily, we don't need to supervise our army anymore. Even with level something mega healers in there. They don't necessarily manage to kill us. Enemies have entered the dungeon. Oh, goodness. Okay, so, okay, so, oh, okay, this looks much better now. I think we fixed the issue. Like, I want to believe that is my issue. That's my error, that I'm misusing something. Like, I'm not doing it properly, you know? I, I want to believe that, but looking at what the heck, whatever that was down there, I'm not quite sure that is even the case. Come on, one more, and then we got that in the bag. Should we like some more frozen enemies? I think we should. We'll just open another freezer chamber here. All right. There's some evilness laying around there somewhere. Let's just go intercept that shipment and then we go further. 
Level 10. We done did it. And that is to the max. Advance all factions research in sockets. So we got it. So we can we can actually... I think we can finish now. Yeah. Okay, we can finish now. Or can we? We'll select this. Throw it in there. The fifth stone was Let's see. In the corresponding rune socket. The ritual could begin. Hmm? I knew it! Not only have I now wasted so much time dragging these damn stones around everywhere. No! Naturally, this nonsense is just going to keep going on forever! Let me guess what their next mission's about. Well, of course, it could well be that there were heroes who would try to disrupt the ritual. A certain dwarf queen somehow comes to mind. Oh, of course, that makes sense. If you have to buy yourself some more game time somewhere, then you might as well do it right. The keyboard torturing hack cobbling this story together better hope I never get my hands on him. Um, yeah. Train five units to above level 10 in the rune. Uh, okay, we didn't do that. I didn't really understand how to do it. <laughs> I think with the XP boost or something? Ah, well, it's fine. It took us long enough to get this. That's fair enough. So, um, we didn't get the thing either, which you had to have a bunch of creatures for. Not sure why we didn't get that, because we did have all those. But okay, this has happened before. We really don't understand anymore. But, as for it, for us, today, I'm tired, I'm sad, I did enjoy the mission though, but I'm still tired and sad, so I'm gonna go be tired and sad elsewhere. Thank you very much for watching, hope you did enjoy, if you did, leave a like, and see you around, maybe go check out the Twitch as well, and we'll see you on the next one, until then, bye bye.